What's up guys? It's your friend Fast Eddie. I'm really excited about this one. Uh, I got this one in actually a couple days ago, but uh, uh, just getting around to filming it now. Anyway, it's the uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre box set from uh, Italy. Now, I got this from Italy, but I believe it's the French box set. Uh, it's pretty limited. I'll show you here on the bottom real quick. I have number 1224 out of 3,000. But this is one cool set, man. It's very thick, hard, sturdy case. And what I love about it, all these cuts are real cuts, man. Uh, hopefully I can pick it up with this camera, but uh, you can see all the slashes are real, the real openings. There we go. The real openings inside the box, which is a very cool touch, man. The artwork around it is really, really cool. It's supposed to be like a faded, rustic look to it. There's the sides. Let's see, it's two different pictures. There's his classic shot here and another one here. But I believe the sides are both the same. You can see there the little hole in it. So yeah, man, it's awesome. Top, and like I said, I already showed you the bottom and stuff. But uh, yeah, what a cool set, man. And this one's got some weight to it too. And I'll show you why, because of all the goodies inside. Now this one slides up. There we go. And it's all packaged in there really nicely. Everything fits real nice inside the box. So they did a nice preparing of this one. And now we can just go through it and I'll show you one by one what comes in it. And first up, oh yeah, it's a Don't Mess With Texas Apron. I didn't open this up either, guys. This is uh, one box set I kind of wanted to keep some of this stuff closed. But uh, I believe Disc Junkie did an unboxing of this. And I think he opened up the apron as well, so you can check that out. But uh, yeah, man, cool apron. And it feels nice, too. Inside the uh, uh, plastic, I can actually feel it. But uh, all right, up next, it was just a little backer sheet that was on there. And then we get a cool little booklet here. It's actually really nice. Um, as you can see, fantastic artwork on the fronts. Uh, side there. And back. And uh, it's pretty thick, man. Uh, it's got some great stuff in here. Uh, great uh, pictures. As well as, uh, <laughs> once again, I can't really read it. But it looks cool. <laughs> but uh, fantastic pictures, man. Awesome stuff. And got some really cool behind-the-scenes pictures as well. And uh, some of these pictures, man, would wait, make fantastic posters. I believe some of them are actually posters, but uh, look at that. I mean, it's just so cool, man. I love behind-the-scenes stuff like this. Awesome stuff, man. Look at that. All right. I guess I don't have time to go through every single one, but oh, I love this shot, too. <laughs> Flip through a couple more here. What a very cool set, man. Nice booklet, too. Awesome. How about that? <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. All right. Iconic picture there. Oh, yeah. Nice. All right. So there is the booklet that comes with it. Like I said, it's really nice. It's not a hardback or anything like that, but it's still nice and thick. Good printing. So, yeah, there's the booklet. And then we get a mini poster with it. I've had probably 10 of these uh, posters now. <laughs> but yeah, there's just the uh, classic movie poster. It's pretty small. I guess maybe uh, 11 by 13, something like that. Then we get some art cards with it. I went ahead and taped this back up because when it came in, it was kind of like all wrinkly and stuff. So it made the uh, uh, set feel all funky. But anyway, I believe it's just four or five of them. Once again, you can check that out on somebody else's unboxing. But anyway, there's the art cards and then the really cool digipack that comes with it. Man, this thing is freaking sweet. Uh, it's huge, too. Wait till I open this thing up here. Obviously, there's the front. Very cool. The side or spine, whatever you want to call it. And then the back. Very cool once again. And then you can actually open this thing up and it makes uh, one big picture, which is awesome. So I'll go ahead and open that up. And here's the inside with the discs. Now underneath the discs is uh, pretty plain. There's nothing really there except like, I guess maybe it's supposed to be like butcher paper underneath with the blood, you know. 
You do get some pretty cool pictures of Leatherface on if they're going to show up. There we go. On each disc, which is nice. And I got these two over here as well. And then you see Swan. Very cool. And now, like I said, if you open up the whole pack itself, it's one giant collage. If I can fit it all in here. This one big collage there. Isn't that awesome? Love it. Love, love, love the artwork. What an awesome digipack, too. So let's fold this guy back up. But yeah, what an awesome set, man. And uh, actually, it wasn't priced too bad for, you know, a limited edition like this. So it's pretty cool, especially if there's only 3,000 of them made. What's well, a pretty low run number nowadays? Because a lot of these uh, box sets and all say, you know, limited edition. And then you look on the box and it's like out of 20,000 or something like that. But, uh,. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's, I guess that's still fairly low, but get all our junk back in here. And then we'll put our apron back in here as well. Stuff it in there. There we go. See, once you put the apron in there, that's another reason I don't want to open up. You know, because it's all nice, fits in there, plastic. And then, you know, if you open up, it'd be kind of a pain in the ass to get it back in there. And nothing would fit in there nice and tight. Yada, yada, yada. Now let's get our cover back on here, and there we go. Man, it's a sweet, sweet set. Probably one of my favorite box sets now that I have, man. It's just, you know, I think it really is that freaking cool. But, yeah. Anyway, so there it is, guys. There is the Texas Chainsaw Massacre box set from Italy. Actually, from France. Bought on the Italian Amazon. <laughs> Got it? All right. Thanks, guys, for watching, and I shall catch you next time.